Since the introduction of the mumps vaccine in 1967, cases of mumps in the U.S. have been uncommon. However, recent outbreaks in different parts of the nation have awakened the virus. We sit down with Dr. Marina Alper, who tells you why it's resurfaced and how to prevent its spread. Um, mumps, it's a disease caused by virus. It's spread by, you know, saliva or respiratory droplets. And, um, can cause, you know, initially kind of general symptoms, headache, fever, body aches, uh, loss of appetite, uh, fatigue. And usually then people develop um, swelling of their parotid glands, which called, you know, parotitis. And in general, uh, it does go away um, within two weeks without, you know, any complications. But um, virus could um, make some inflammation. It, you know, the disease is um, preventable. And um, again, if we could stop spread the virus, you know, you, you have to practice, you know, good hygiene. And they do recommend for people if they have moms or thinking to have moms, you know, not, not uh, be in public. Dr. Alper says both adults and children can get the virus, and anyone with mumps symptoms should reduce contact with others and practice good basic hygiene. Things like washing your hands thoroughly, covering your mouth when sneezing, or coughing and not drinking out of the same containers as someone else. However, she says the best way to reduce your risk is by being vaccinated. So usually in start in um, kids or adult who did not have the immunization, but when it spread, unfortunately, even people who had routine immunization could get disease. Um, in general, it's much lighter cases, um, but it's still, you know, you're still contagious. I feel that virus that, you know, easy to spread, and uh, there is some cases that people don't even know or they have, like, just cold symptoms. And, you know, again, the virus could spread very easily because people not as cautious. Um, and in, you know, other um, people, uh, especially unvaccinated, could cause more severe disease. The recommended immunization routine is the measles, mumps and rubella or MMR vaccine, providing immunity for most people. One of the most common signs of mumps is having discomfort in the salivary glands located in the front of the neck or the parotid glands located immediately in front of the ears. Some other common signs include difficulty chewing, fever and or headache, muscle aches, tiredness and loss of appetite. 